Hi, my name is Jens Rasmussen and I'm a wilderness skills instructor at Jack Mountain Bushcraft and Guide Service in Aroostook, Maine. I'm here in Georgia actually and I'm going to show you what I can do with just a pocket knife. Okay, so this plant here is going to help us with one of the first things we need, cordage. This is going to be very useful along the way since I don't have any supplies with me really and I don't want to tear apart my clothes as much as possible. I can make fishing line with that, put fletchings on an arrow, uh, just tie things together, make, make rope. I need to find my fire making materials so here's a rock down here. We're going to pull out and see if it can help me. We'll come in uh, close and, and see if we can strike a, a spark off this. Did you see that? We can maybe actually break it open, get some sharper edges, and that will be what we're going to use to start our fire. Okay, so I've uh, picked a spot for my camp here, and I'm going to build a fire in a minute, but one of the jobs that I want to accomplish when this fire is going, besides purifying my water, is uh, to make some char cloth. Char cloth is something that's going to catch a spark very easily, and it's made from cotton uh, that has been uh, carbonized. I don't have any cotton on me except my underwear so I'm gonna cut up my underwear and uh, use that um, now some people have said that uh, I'm cheeky that's what counts so I've cut this uh, can in half and I've cut up my cotton underwear and uh, I'm gonna throw that in there and Put it back together. I'm going to stick that in the fire and then I should have char cloth. I think I found some really good tinder today that will take a spark, but I can't rely on that. You know, if, 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 it's, uh, if we get some rainy weather, uh, I'm going to need something I can rely on like char cloth. So that's why I'm taking the time to make it.